If you want to have hundreds of millions of credits, you can purchase Forza Motorsport 7 or Forza Horizon 3 credits from the link in the description from Digizani. They provide cheap, fast and reliable credits for as low as £3. You can also use code JAKE for 5% off your order. How's it going everyone? JakeXCX here, back on Forza Horizon 3 once again. I think it's been over a week since I've done a Forza Horizon 3 video. I've recently done a video regarding my new bike which I purchased a couple weeks ago. There'll be a picture on screen if you're interested in seeing my new bike. But today on Forza Horizon 3 we are in a Bugatti Veyron. It is a modded Bugatti Veyron. As you can see I'm going to put my foot down. That's a fast Veyron. Oh, I went right off his bottom. Now, it's got a standard Bugatti Veyron engine in it, and we, we've done engine swaps a lot in the past. We've usually engine swapped a really good engine into a really slow car. But we're going to do the opposite. We're going to give this Bugatti Veyron a ridiculously slow engine to see how funny it is, and then we'll mod up the slow engine, just, just, just for fun. I have two cars in mind. I have the Reliant Supervan three-wheeler, and also a Volvo. So the first thing we're going to do is head to the auto show and we are going to put a Reliant Supervan three-wheeler engine in this Veyron and it's going to be so slow. I think what I'm going to do first is go in a race with 11 other Reliants. So it's me in a Veyron with a Reliant engine against 11 other Reliants and to be honest I'm probably going to lose because I'm going to weigh a lot more than them. <laughs> Okay, here we go. In the engines. Conversion. Engine swap. Oh, yes. Oh, my absolute God. I don't know why the engine name is that. Colour. 2550. 255255. Engine name TBD. Colour. 000255. I'm presuming this is the Reliance engine, which has 32 horsepower. And I'm presuming this is the Volvo's engine, which has a reasonable 240. Now, obviously, the first thing we're going to do, let's put a Reliant Supervan engine in this bad boy. 93 miles an hour. Look at that, kids. Look at that. Here we go. Put my foot down. Look at that instant gear change. <laughs> Tell you what, let's try an auto 60, shall we? 0-60 in a Bugatti Veyron with a Reliant Veyron... Reliant Veyron? Reliant Supervan engine. Now, I just tried to do a 0-60 starting from the auto show and it didn't even reach it. It started to de-accelerate at 50 miles an hour when I went up this hill. So I'll try it again. A 0-60 time in this Veyron with a Reliant engine. Here we go. Yeah, 60 miles an hour. I don't know how long that was. I'm sure it's going to be on screen. <laughs> Here we go, starting up a race. Now, I've just remembered that to drive my Veyron in a Reliant race, I need to allow Veyrons to ride. But um, luckily, all of these Veyrons that you see, they have Reliant engines. So here we go. There's going to be a couple of Reliants about as well. Let's see how badly I do. And oh... Oh, that guy in front, he shot off. Come on, Veyrons, we've got this. No. We need to work on blocking them. No, stay back. Stay back. <laughs> Is that my... He's overtaking me. No, get away. I will knock you over after two. No, get away. Yeah, you're dead, mate. No. Come back here. Come back here. I'll ram you if I have to. Yeah, you're dead. <laughs> I'm going full throttle, by the way, guys. And these guys have the same engine as me, but they weigh nothing. It barely even gets to 60 miles an hour now. Oh, I'm catching these geezers up. Go on, mate. Urgh, catch him up. No. No, come back here. <laughs> oh, that's the way to do it. Oh, yes. Well, I think it's probably safe to say I win now. Winning. 
Uh-oh, they're catching me up. No! Stay back. Stay away. Oh! No. Got him. I need to get the red one now. Which way are you going? I missed him! No! Uh-oh. I'm on the I'm on the finish straight here. They're catching up to me. Look at the look at the mirrors. No. No. If if I if I lose to these, I swear to god. Good, stay back, stay back. Don't overtake me. Don't overtake me. You come back here, you. You come back here. Well, that's annoying. Okay, time to play with the other engine, which is a Volvo engine. And we're going to mod this up a bit. So it's going to be a Volvo engine, but it's going to be fast-ish. You know, it's going to be pretty weird. I'm guessing this is it. 240 brake horsepower. So it's 240 is quite a lot. We're going to stick all the mods on it like this. Oh, yeah. I mean, three, four hundred horsepower is still not much for a Bugatti Veyron, but oh well. We'll get it a lot higher than 400 horsepower. I bet this sounds pretty cool as well. Oh, you can hear it. So that sounds nice. I don't know. I don't understand how Forza have managed to make the slowish car's engine sound better than the fast ones. Now, obviously, let's have a bit of fun. Now, we've got some slow engines in it. Now, obviously, we're going to make them a little bit faster. Just have to turn my resolution down just a tad, just to make it a bit more bearable. Let's add a supercharger to it. A supercharged Volvo 850R engine in a Bugatti Veyron. I feel sorry for anyone who clicked on this video expecting it to be literally just slow engines in a Veyron. We had a look at the Reliant engine in it, and it has some fun in some races, but I don't want to stick the whole video to just that. What I've just done there is increase the RPM to 10,000, so I think the speedometer is going to glitch. If we have a look at the speedometer... <laughs> I love it when it goes around it like that. As I mentioned, you know, we do as I mentioned at the beginning of the video, we tend to do mostly fast engine swaps and to be honest, this is kind of one as well, but the one we did earlier putting the Reliant in Bugatti, it's it's just a bit different, isn't it? And if any of you can think of anything different to do on the dev build that's just going to be funny, interesting or just cool, pop it down in the comment section below. You can even look through my previous videos, see if you can get any ideas from any of those. What I've just done now is set the speedometer to only go up to 3,000 RPM. However, the car redlines at 12,000. So this is going to be funny. Oh, that is just ridiculous, and it's hurt my ears. So we're going to go back to the Reliant now and see if we can mess up with the Reliant for the last little bit of the video. I agree, it's not been the most massive video in the world. However, we've got to play around with some slow engines in the Bugatti Veyron and also mod them up a little bit. Here we go, we're back in the slow one now. Come on, you can do it. Go, 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 go. We're going to have to give it a supercharger here, aren't we? because it's just so stupidly slow. Ah, 
That's more like it. Now she's got a little bit of power. Power, they're on power. You know, just out of curiosity, for some of you who don't know, there's actually a built-in machine in the game, or not machine, a built-in feature which will automatically drive the car for you and test its 0 to 60 time. And I'd say we should do that. Go to PI calculator and what does it say? It says it's going to take 45 seconds to get there. Let's let it run. My hands are not on the controller, it's going to do all this on its own. I mean, I'd have thought it'd at least steer itself, come on. Oh, I forgot it doesn't change gear. Oh, we'll forget that then. The other thing said it'd take 45 seconds. And in 45 seconds, God knows what the Veyron could do. Well, something I am going to try, keyword is try to do, to one of these cars um, for a video idea, is the Reliant Supervan, as you all know, has three wheels. So that means that somewhere in the Forza files that's obviously it's obviously compatible to have cars that only have three wheels which means I'm gonna try and see if I can get like a Bugatti Veyron or a Hennessy Venom to have three wheels just like the Reliant because that'll be really funny I'm gonna see if I can do that no promises though but I've got a few other ideas in my head and as as I always say it's open for suggestions from all of you if you can think of anything funny like this or interesting let me know that's going to be it for today, ladies. If you're interested in my new bike, which I managed to purchase a couple weeks ago, that I've done a recent video on, please check it out. Other than that, leave a like if you've enjoyed. Subscribe if you haven't for more Forza content. And I'll see you all. Oh, I think we just really top speed in the next video.